Hi, I'm David Navarez, and today I'll be talking to you about James Duan's book, Do You Have the Right to Remain Innocent, which he, which he spoke some very interesting facts and showed very promising evidence about why not, why not, why you shouldn't talk to police. And some reasons he said you shouldn't talk to police is because they, they'll use whatever they want to incriminate you. Whatever, whatever statement you write, the prosecutor has a right to only, you only use what, what she has against you. Also, another very interesting fact I found was that um, he, he said to never plead the fifth. And which, which was very interesting to me because you plead the fifth, you have the right to remain silent. And, as, and if you plead the fifth, you have, um, it's also basically a statement that you're, in, that you're admitting guilt, which can, which, can, which, can cause, which can cause them to prosecute you for a crime. And also, one interesting case study that James Duan talked about was how of of a lady, of a lady who who wrote a statement on how she was just a lookout, on I think it was a bank robbery. But don't but once the once the prosecutor read her statement and had she had written that one of one of her one of her accomplices had shot a lady, in in the court the prosecutor ha had lied and had lied and didn't give all the facts from her statement, and prosecuted her for for the shooting of, for the shooting of the young lady. And also, which was very, which was very, uh, one interesting topic James Wen mentioned was the it was the interrogation tactics of police. He mentioned that the police interrogation tactics work so well that they can make an innocent person plead guilty. And most interrogations last over sixteen hours, so people so people become tired, fatigue, and they get and and sick of all the interrogation that they just admit. To they just admit to have be have done a crime, but they never they never. They admit to doing a crime they never done. Another subject James Wan mentioned is how police try to act like they're your friend, and they try to make a deal with you, saying if you talk, we can help you. If you don't talk, it won't go good for you, and they'll try to make a deal with you. But the police have no power to make a deal with you. So, also, police and prosecutors tell their children not to talk to police, and if they, and if they ever get caught, ask for a ask for a lawyer, and don't say nothing.